Here comes a man who loves to fight. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring, representing the Brawling Brutes from Dublin, Ireland. Weighing in at 267 pounds, the Celtic Warrior, Sheamus. Looking at the career of Sheamus, he's been successful in both singles and tag team competition. Now the Celtic Warrior can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with anyone who steps up to him. You are looking at the future of the Bloodline. And his opponent, representing the Bloodline from Las Vegas, Nevada, weighing in at 250 pounds, Solo Sikoa. Solo is a man who annihilates the competition with ruthless and unflinching efficiency. We've learned that the enforcer of the Bloodline is not about talking. He is all action. One thing is for certain with Solo in the ring, we're about to see a beatdown. The Celtic warrior Sheamus is already ready for a fight. No matter the place, no matter the odds, this gritty superstar has never backed down. He's truly as tough as they come. And we've seen that toughness of Sheamus tested in some truly brutal matches. When you're in the ring with the Celtic warrior, you are in for a rough morning after. I think Sheamus is excited to get down to business here and prove his toughness once again. He's got to get through the enforcer, Solo Sokoa, though. And Solo is not someone you just get through. Uh, most superstars are lucky if they can simply survive Solo. He's just so menacing. Hey, look at my arms. I've got goosebumps, and I'm not even in the match. Into the cover. And he easily stops the ref's count. Not getting a two count at this point has to be frustrating. And Solo Sokoa looking to hype himself up here. He is looking to do some serious harm. And this one might be headed ringside. Look at how dominant Sheamus is, Corey. So what needs to be done tonight to put the Celtic Warrior away? You need to take out his legs, which power the devastating Brogue Kick. If you don't neutralize this, it can be lights out in a hurry. Well-placed elbow to break up the maneuver. Oh, what a close line. it right back. Close line. Carefully measured knee drop. And it looks like Solo is bleeding. Oh my Look at goodness. This from the ground up. Power slam. Well, they say everyone has a plan until they get punched in the mouth. Well, someone just threw their plan out the window. Take off. The one-two punch of high risk, high reward. Oh, it went. Bang, man. Solo must be getting phased by this attack. Solo has to find a way to turn things around. And an elbow drop for added measure. You know that attack had to hurt because Sheamus was the one delivering it. Looking to cause as much damage. And that's all she wrote. Here is your winner, the Celtic.
Ultimate Warrior, Shame! Members of Solo Sokoa's family refer to him as the Enforcer. It's a title that aptly describes his demeanor, which is equal parts stoic and violent. Solo seems almost completely emotionless at times. Even while he's in the middle of tearing apart an opponent, his grim expression never changes. He's truly merciless. Yeah, no question that when it comes to in-ring action, Solo Sokoa is all business. And then we've got a born and bred brawler, Sheamus. Whenever a fight breaks out in WWE, there's a good chance Sheamus is at the middle of it, handing out punishment to anyone who gets in his way. It's not pretty, but Sheamus is very good at what he does. And what he does is get brutal. Sheamus shows no regard for his opponent's well-being. He holds nothing back. He's always out to inflict pain with the most vicious attack he can think of. Tagging this outside. This could be good. A stop in the leg. Just nasty. Sakoa just unable to stop this attack. Impressive moves from Sheamus, guys. Ooh. Ooh wow. Lights out. Up on their shoulders, down in a hurry. Yeah. Referees count at seven. They need to get back into the ring. He climbs back into the ring just in time. That was getting close. It's got to be hard to tell what a brawler like Sheamus is going to throw at you. The man can do so much damage with any part of his body. A single punch or kick from Sheamus can put any opponent down, Cole, but you can't hit what you can't catch. So if this guy stays out of... They're going to catch him off guard. And a shoulder in the air. He is going to take this match as long and as far as he needs to. A stalemate of counters. And Sokoa needed that badly. Yes, yeah, incoming. Oh, great flurry of offense from Solo. There you see it staying out of Sheamus' reach, and he finally found the opening. A uh, stop right to the gut. Vice-like grip on the trapezius muscle. This is terribly painful. Here's a cover. And he breaks the count quickly. Still in it. Wait, 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 wait! No, he bites the shoulder before three. That was a long two count there. Reversal catches Sheamus there. off with an elbow. Ouch! Oh, man! Oh, my gosh! What impact! Stomping! Ouch! Jameis setting up! Breakers. And there's no doubt he'll be cursing Sheamus' name for weeks after that. Boom! Running STO plants him. Nicely done. Boom! Solo with a tight. Uh oh. He reverses it. Just turn that around. Tagged with a punch. And Sheamus really having the fight brought to him there. And hanging tough, but beginning to show some wear and tear. Might want to think about picking up the pace a bit. Showing no regard for their opponent's well-being now. Perched on the middle rope. Diving headbutt. Throat. Oh man, what a leg drop! 
The fight is being taken to Sheamus. Look, Sheamus loves the fight, but he can't be liking this. Sokoa, he is getting rid of the turnbuckle pad. Don't say that too loud, Saxon, you might get caught. Rearing way back. Boom! Samoan spike. So we can end this now. He kicks out somehow. What a kick out. This is unbelievable resolve being shown by the Celtic Warrior. I thought it was over. The WWE Universe thought it was over. But you got to do a little more to finally finish this. After what we've seen so far, you cannot question the lengths these superstars are willing to go. The limits of physical exhaustion are being surpassed at this point. Fought back with a punch to the gut. Caught with a clothesline. Momentum clearly on the side of Sokoa. Solo's really on top of his game right now. Out of the ring. What's his plan here? Uh-oh. Oh, my God! Gut first into the barricade! Oh, that's you in your head. He'll head to the ring. Solo Sokoa signaling to the audience, and they are responding. What are you guys thinking? Obviously not about the ref's count, Cole. Beat the count back in. This one will continue. The Celtic Warriors' chances are waning. The power of shame is being suppressed. Beating heel kick. Rearing way back. Samoan spike. Solo Sokoa stands victorious here tonight. Sokoa unshakable as ever during the match. And that combination of stoicism and intensity simply pays dividends.